Alright guys, ito na yung pinakabago na dumating sa Samsung. It's the Samsung Galaxy A50. And this has been released this month lang, March of 2019. And as you can see, it is it has triple camera. And ito yung parang midnight black or gray na variant niya. At it has, it is sporting the Infinity V na display. Okay? And the weight of this actually when i habang hinahan hina, hinahawakan ko to talagang hindi naman siya ganoon kabigat akala ko nga plastic kaya lang hindi naman pala siya, pala siya plastic it's 166 grams and 7.7 mm thick yan yung itong side na to na pinapakita ko sa inyo para siyang plastic kaya lang hindi naman pala parang glass foot pa rin naman pala siya it is uh, it has uh, expandable memory pa rin. as you can see up there there's a microphone and then sa gilid and and dyan yung expandable me memory card slot it is ano, a whopping 6.4 inch display uh, super amoled capacitive touchscreen and then yung pinaka main camera niya is 25 megapixel it has 6 gigabytes of ram and 4000 milliamp of battery. So ayun guys, yan. All day battery, all around multi-camera, triple rear, 25, 8 and 5 megapixels, low light, wide angle and the all new display. Tsaka it is only 17,990 pesos. Yan. As you can see, it is sporting the new Samsung One UI and I will try here now the camera which is very amazing kasi dahil diyan dahil sa wide angle camera na yan I love it uh, this really good for vlogging kagaya nung kakalabas lang na Samsung Galaxy S10 family, eto naman is A50 it's not really a budget phone it is more of a mid range phone kasi 18,000 na siya so yun, I'm just really amazed with the uh, wide angle, super ultra wide angle ng camera so yan. And then, ito yung mga choices niya. May 3 is to 4, 19 by 6 na ano, na ratio, at saka yung full. Yan. Ito ako. <laughs> Yan. See? I'm just showing you actually the, the light effect of the front camera or yung notch. See? May ganyan siyang. So, Samsung is really... Uh, masasabi natin na in-embrace talaga nila yung notch. Uh, they're not trying to hide it. They're not trying to uh, disregard it. They're even putting some animations around it para i-embrace na nila yung, ano, yung notch Infinity V or O display. Yan. O ba yun? Brav Infinity V. Parang Infinity V yata. Yan. So sa sa actual guys, maganda yung colors niya. It has Corning Gorilla Glass 3. Of course, it is sporting the new Android Pie or 9.0 and it is an octa-core na processor, uh, front glass, plastic body. Yun pala, ah, kaya pala front glass at plastic body pala siya. So, dito tinitingnan ko yung mga uh, photos ng uh, stock photos na naka-save sa ano maganda talaga siya parang ano lang parang kagaya lang din ng Samsung, Samsung S10 kaya lang actually yun yun yung pinaka ayo ayo ko talaga na parang kung dito makita nyo talagang sa gilid di ba may notch ewan ko kung bakit bakit hindi naman ako iPhone hater or Oppo or Vivo hater kaya lang yung hindi, hindi gaya nung sa S10, yung isang ano lang, isang punch hole lang. Hindi siya ganun ka ka obvious. Hindi gaya nito, 'di ba? Parang uh, mas maganda kasi kapag ano yung frame is talagang square or parang rectangular, yung ano yung full rectangular na effect. Ito kasi parang napapansin mo, ewan ko sa inyo. Napapansin ko talaga yung parang notch sa gilid. So, yun, I'm just really browsing here. And then, yeah. What else? This is available na uh, March, and then it has a it has a loudspeaker, 
at meron pa rin siyang 3.5 mm na headphone jack. Punta naman tayo sa blue, blue color. Maganda tong blue, elect, parang electric blue na color. So, uh, yan. I'm just trying to hold it every, uh, in my hand just to see and feel kung gano'n siya kaliit. Yun pala guys, par- plastic daw yung sa... Pero, feeling ko kasi parang glass yung likod. Hindi ko lang sure ah. Research nyo na lang. <laughs> Basta ito yung ano lang, parang first hand, hands on. At ito yung pinakagusto ko actually yung white na variant. Yan, tingnan niyo yung white, di ba? Hindi siya kagaya ng white or pearl prism ng S10, kaya lang meron din siyang ganung effect na parang uh, nagdi parang nadi-disperse nadi-dis- yung color at it creates a rainbow effect. Yan mag maganda, di ba? Tsaka ang maganda dito na gusto ko rin kasi yung pinaka-frame ng full front glass niya is uh, may may ano siya, may black tingnan niyo, parang may black na nakapaligid. Yan, di ba? May black na parang pinaka-frame ng front. So, maganda siya pag ginamit mo yung sa One UI na dark. Yan. Parang dark. Uh, try natin. Yung dark. Dark na ano. Dolby sound is not. This, this, this hasn't ano, the Dolby Atmos feature. So, di ba? Pag dark siya, magandang tingnan. Parang isa, isa siyang pina, parang one whole glass display lang siya. So, yun. Maganda siya sa, ano, sa hand. At tsaka, again, it's available in black, white, blue, at tsaka coral sa ibang mga bansa. Pero dito sa Philippines, yun lang. Uh, blue, white, at tsaka black. Black pala yun. So, again, this is uh, 18,000 pesos. So, if you're looking for a very budget phone na hindi naman ganun ka-budget, na alam mo naman na maganda yung, kasi super AMOLED LED na siya, di ba? AMOLED capacitive screen na siya, guys. At saka pala, etong ano to, I was, well, I was holding this. Napasin ko na, nasan ba yung ano? Nasan ba yung fingerprint reader? Ito yung pinaka speaker niya, tsaka yung 3.5 mm headphone jack. Napasin ko na wala. So, I, I looked at the specifications again. At ano pala siya? In-display fingerprint reader. So, unfortunately guys, hindi ko lang siya matry dito kasi ano siya, dummy phone lang siya. Parang hindi nila, hindi kagaya noon ng S7 na family. Hindi nila nilagyan ng kapas, uh, parang ability to try out the fingerprint scanner. So, eto, hinahanap ko dito sa settings. Asan ba yung fingerprint na mga uh, settings? Kaya lang di ko siya makita. So, yun, di ba? Yun, wala. Kahit dyan, wala. So, if I go to the other settings, wala din. Wala. Kahit sa ibang set, yun, wala. Walang fingerprint scanner. Which is, parang pangit kasi hindi natin mapakita sa inyo kung gano'ng kabilis yung fingerprint reader. Kahit doon sa Galaxy S10, hindi rin natin mapakita kasi wala nga, wala siyang gano'ng uh, ability sa mga dummy phone. So, sorry if wala akong mapakita. Ano na lang. Bili na lang kayo para matry nyo. So, yun. Ano pa ba? Tingnan natin ulit yung specifications na nakalagay sa, ano ha, nakalagay sa pinaka-display niya. So, ayun siya. So, all new display, 6.4 Infinity U pala. Infinity U display, I stand corrected. Full HD+, plus Super AMOLED, at saka on-screen fingerprint unlock. So, if I'm not mistaken, this has the same uh, technology with the Samsung S10. So, tingnan natin. Research muna natin sa, sa internet, ha? Fingerprint. Tingnan natin. So, on-screen fingerprint sensor. Ewan ko lang kung ultrasonic pa rin to, guys. Two talaga pa rin to. So, hindi ko alam kung ultrasonic pa rin to. Basta, nasa under the screen yung, ano, yung fingerprint scanner niya. Let's try naman sa ibang mga wallpaper. Wala siyang uh, live wallpaper or yung mga moving wallpapers. So, I'm just trying out the other stuff, pero parang uh, wag na lang kasi maganda naman yung wallpaper na nakalagay dyan din. Pag lang natin i-try, yan. 
maganda rin niya naman yung web wallpaper na yan. So, I'm just trying out the other apps. So, internet and then messages. Yeah, it's really one UI of course. And then, let's try the calls. Yan. And then, what else? Alarms or clock. Ganun pa rin siya. And then, what else? Uh, let's go to Samsung Notes and go to I guess calculator. So it's really really the stock uh, one UI. And then let's try to go to galleries. And mga pictures. And you can always pinch and zoom in and out. Uh, try natin ng ibang apps. Uh, ano ba? Try natin yung asphalt. Ito guys, sa tingnan nyo. Ilang seconds lang yan. Ilang seconds lang yan. Yun! Ayun na! Diba? So, very, very... Uh, I don't think it's about the dummy phone. Talagang mabilis siya. Mabilis siya. And let's try now. Let's try the... A little bit of RAM management. I Again, I know this is just a dummy phone. But let's try to see lang naman. Kasi this is the only thing that we have uh, available to try on. So, yung calendar is just still there. And then, internet is still there in the memory. Messages is still there. And then, calls are still there. And then, alarms are still there. Wow! Very, very nice. Uh, Samsung notes are still there. Uy! Uh, parang refresh ba yun? Ewan ko sa... Uh, Ewan ko kung refresh yun. Pati yung gallery app, feeling ko refresh na yun. Ito naman is hindi. Yung games is hindi. So, it's, it's very... Uh, impressive, ah, yung games is still in the memory. So, how about you guys? What do you want? Do you do you think you want to buy the Samsung Galaxy A50? Uh, it sports the Galaxy U, Infinity U display. Uh, I don't, uh, I don't think it will be good for my. Uh, level of use kasi I'm used to ano na, uh, Galaxy Note 8 but how about you uh, do you want to buy the Ga Galaxy A50 for those of you are looking for a little bit of features na my wide angle camera I think this is for you if you're a vlogger I think it's really good because hindi naman siya ganun kabigat that's it you guys I hope you enjoyed this first look and hands on